Hello and welcome to the weekly roundup from the Chesterfield Post. I'm Karen Johnson. News this week have proposed boundary changes in Chesterfield after a review by the Boundary Commission for England. A 12-week consultation period is now taking place with proposals available to view at the Town Hall and Staveley Hall. Under the proposals, Barrow Hill and New Whittington will move to become part of the Chesterfield constituency and Lowgates and Woodthorpe will transfer to Bolsover. 40 jobs will be coming to Chesterfield as major retailer Toys R Us prepares to open a new store on Spire Walk Park later this month. The 23,000 square foot premises will open on the 20th of October with a grand opening on the 22nd. Bosses say it's a multi-million pound investment and that they are looking forward to opening their most modern store yet in the town. In another boost for the town, council bosses told us that three development partners for the Northern Gateway project have now been picked. It means the outline proposals for the Donut Car Park area will now be submitted. The area is expected to be developed into high quality shopping experience. The Market Hall is about to get a new lease of life too, with news that plans to upgrade it have now been approved by the Council's Planning Committee. Work is expected to begin in February 2012 and existing tenants will be housed in a temporary market building on New Square from Christmas. This is the face of John Weir who, from Chesterfield, who's now in jail after being found guilty of growing more than 100 cannabis plants at a Sheepbridge factory. He was sentenced to 22 months in prison. Chesterfield's B2 Net Stadium hosted its second international this week as the England under-15s took on the Northern Irish lads as part of the Victory Shield campaign. The stadium was packed with 4,126 attending to see the English stars of the future beat their Irish counterparts 3-1. There was an acclaimed performance by local lad Mason Bennett from Shirebrook, who scored two of the goals. The FA declared the turnout excellent. Eight-year-old Josh Stevenson from Chesterfield, who won the Chesterfield Post mascot competition, led the England team out. And ahead of tomorrow's derby game at, with Notts County at the stadium, news has come in that striker Scott Bowden has gone to Macclesfield on a month's emergency loan. Manager John Sheridan says it will give Scott match experience. For further details on any of these stories, go to our website www.chesterfieldpost.co.uk and I'll be back next week with a further roundup.